Here's how to set up multi outs in Native Instruments Contact in Logic Pro X. For example, if you want to put each piece of a drum kit on separate tracks in Logic. This tutorial uses my Robot Dog Drums drum sample library, but the same instructions will apply to a variety of contact libraries as well. Start a new project in Logic or create a track in an existing project. Select Software Instrument, make the instrument contact, multi output 16 times stereo. Hit create. With the contact plugin window now open, the first thing you want to do is go find the outputs panel. Now that you can see the outputs panel, select presets, go to factory, stereo 16x. You definitely want to choose a stereo configuration because contact sometimes crashes with mono outputs. Once you have these 16 outputs in the output panel, you can now open up your contact instrument. Make sure you do configure those outputs first before you load the instrument, or those outputs might not be available until you close and reload the instrument. We'll go over to Robot Dog Drums Rock. Now with these 16 outputs available, you can go into the mixer, and you can select which output you'd like which track to come out on. There are some presets down here. Once you've selected your outputs for each track, open the Logic Mixer. Here you have the track with contact on it. Just click on this little plus. That will create an additional track for each of those outputs. Hit the plus as many times as you need. You can then name these tracks accordingly. That pretty much covers it in Logic. One additional thing to know is that the reverb will always come out on the first stereo pair. That is, unless you go up and hit this I button right here, and then change this output to a different output. This will determine which output the reverb is sent to. Thanks for watching, I hope this was helpful. Check out Robot Dog Drums if you haven't already. Cheers! Wishing I could turn the hands back Talk instead about the moon You laugh and I see attitude